Hello, Vassar. Hello, Hello. What, Here we are, Mobile World Congress 2024, doing this again, all over again. Very excited, exciting, a lot of excitement going on. A lot of momentum in open, virtualized brand. We have a fantastic partnership. A lot of things that we are doing and learning together. What? Are, how did you see things? Hello, Christina. Thank you very much for this uh, conversation. By the way, I mean, the you know, it's really exciting to be here. First of all, to see all of our customers and the partnership that we have created together. Uh, in my opinion, is working very well especially some of the things that Intel seeded originally, um, you know, with its FlexRAN capability and ORAN, and just kick-starting that whole ORAN momentum in the market. We are really seeing traction now, you know. Um, sustainability is becoming really important. What are you thinking? So definitely sustain sustainability, very important. The work that we're doing to optimize our solution. Then one of the things that we're doing better in the industry, as, as an industry, is that collaboration. And again, back to our partnership, when you take FlexRAN and OpenShift, the things that we're doing to integrate, to optimize, to do, to, to give better solutions to our, to the operators and our customers is fantastic. You know, we're hearing the same thing, Christina. You know, from, from our service provider's perspective, sustainability is a huge topic. For them, power reduction is a big deal. And what Intel has done with Intel Power Manager is a fantastic tool that can be enabled in OpenShift to reduce you know, power up to 30%. And we're showing some good demos here on there, MWC there show floor. There's a few demos here with power reduction, in the power management. Uh, I encourage everybody to go and check it out. Pretty, pretty good, pretty good stuff. Indeed, and, and I think to prove it in the real world is exactly, in, exactly more important, right? Uh, the work Intel has done, for example, in contributing to Kepler project to provide better visibility of our usage across the entire system. And, uh, you know, the uh, RIC collaboration that we've done, both Intel and Red Hat together, again, to tune the radio infrastructure, to uh, look at overall as a complete system, not just the node, right? And that's really what I'm excited about in terms of how the collaboration can bring overall benefits. So, so true. And this is the thing, when you have a network that is software-defined network, that is a virtualized network, this is the kind of thing that you can do. And the fact that you can innovate at the, at, at the speed of software, and you can do the things that we're doing together to have a more optimized, more sustainable network. Look, indeed, right? I give a lot of credit to Intel for that. The credit that I give to Intel is in terms of creating that momentum, creating that impetus to to go into the software-defined space and, and build this level of architectures, build this level of collaboration partners. Um, and I'm and in, in the future, I'm actually looking forward to doing many more things, including collaborating in the areas of AI, core networking, uh, with the new generation of Intel platforms that are coming out. I'm super excited. Unlimited potential of what we are going to do together. So much to look forward to it. What's next? Yeah, look, AI is a big area. It's a big challenge, in my opinion. Um, and especially the progress that Intel's made in the GPU space um, and something new that's coming out in the future. I think the good part is we're getting in the forefront of that collaboration, right? It's not after the fact. So with the Red Hat software, with Red Hat tools, Red Hat OpenShift AI, we can actually to deliver really the whole ML ops capability to the customers. And I think that's really a key area. And of course, optimization is always important um, in terms of the infrastructure. So uh, looking uh, forward to absolutely. it. Absolutely. And in the area of AI, as we say, AI everywhere, we just announced, as you probably heard, the Intel VRAN AI development kit. So you can have, you can do your entire AI workload in the in the virtual DU. You don't need any external component. You can do everything in that software-defined network for the entire and for, for the entire brand uh, workload. Wow, that's game, going to be a game changer in my opinion because we have OpenShift AI also coming out, and I think look literally now leveraging that toolkit, making it part of the system, making part of the platform. I'm, I'm sure we can Absolutely really do wonders. Absolutely fantastic. Thank Asar, you. Asar, thank you so much. Thank you for being here, and thank you especially for the partnership. Thank you, Christina. It was thank my pleasure so to be here. Thank, thank you. you. I will be done.